I just came home from Beijing 2022, my second Winter Olympics. And this vlog, I'm gonna give you my top five reasons why you should go to the Olympics. First of them is the fact that you can go see any other sport there is while you're at the Winter Olympics. You get to see all the cool athletes from all the sports, literally the best athletes in the world. You can go chat with different people. You get a lot of new friends in my case. I met a lot of cool people that I would never have bumped to in the world of skating where I'm from from Denmark and from other countries at well, as well. So you can go to any venue. I had the chance to go watch some short track skating and also some figure skating on the final day of the Olympics after I was done with my own events. But you could really go to any sport while you're at the Olympics. And for almost any athlete, it's not an everyday competition thing. I had a race on the second day of the Olympics and the very last day of the Olympics. And even though I train a lot, the days in between are not 100% fully packed with training. So there was time to go see different things. Those things were incredibly cool. You can also, it's a longer drive, but you could also go up to the mountains. I didn't have that chance, but also see some of the skiing events and the snowboard events. Second reason you would want to go to the Olympics is the fact that you get a 24 seven, all you can eat buffet, not just any buffet. It is all the food in the world. They make a really good job at the winter Olympics and summer Olympics to have any sort of food available for all the skaters or all the athletes that are there at the Olympics. It's a huge food court in Pyeongchang. It was even bigger here in Beijing. They had a two floor food court where you just pick up a tray and then you can have almost any food you can think of. It is really a world cuisine. There's also delicious desserts and on the top of that you can get all the soda you can drink and that's really not too bad. As an athlete I try and stay to the diet stuff but had diet Sprite, diet Coke Zero, and uh, I, I really did my best to make use of that. Third reason you should try and make it to the Olympics is all the cool facilities that you would find inside the Olympic Village. The training facilities are really the best of the best that you would ever get. They have done all they could to find out what every athlete in every sport would need to prepare in the best way possible. There is a huge gym, again, open 24-7, where you can find all the cardio machines you would need and there is more than 10 squat racks, 10 leg press, 10 bench press, there's all this, all you could need. And, um, and same goes for all the different venues. So if you're at the skating arena, you would have kind of the same setup or even better in the skating arena's case. And all the other venues that I've been to, it was the same thing. Training at the Olympics is also really fun, even though we go there for racing. Other facilities, things to just make it more fun to be at the Olympics. A lot of people end up staying there for a long time. I was there for almost a month and we were in a COVID bubble, so I couldn't go out there. I couldn't explore. I couldn't see the Great Wall of, of China, sadly. I did get, get to play some virtual reality games. I did some ping pong table tennis with my fiance. We had pool billiard and just a lot of cool things for us to, to spend time there. That makes it a lot easier to be kind of trapped in a little bubble for almost a month. Fourth reason you should try and make it to the Olympics is all the volunteers that are there. Trust me, if you go to the Olympics, you will definitely agree with me. The fact that 30,000 people were there in Beijing just for us, volunteering to give us the best possible experience makes it something you'll never forget. They were grateful just to be there to help us, which is surreal. They were so nice and they were just cheering us up, not just when we were racing, not just cheering for us during the competitions, but all the time as we were there, the Olympics, everybody wished us good luck and they were all just incredibly kind and, and friendly to us. We even did some pin trading, gave them some of our national pins. We tried to make conversation with them. We ended up taking a few selfies with them and I brought a Polaroid camera. So on the final day, I went to the cafeteria and Sophia, my girlfriend, and I, we took a photo with all the volunteers there on a Polaroid and gave it to them as a memory. And they were so happy for that. And things like that really make it worth it to be not just at the Olympics, but being an athlete in general. We just had a lot of cool experiences. When we were waiting for laundry one day, we ended up playing table tennis with the volunteers, having a full tournament. And at the end of it, even though they kicked our butts, they, they still gave us some presents, some lanterns that we could bring home with us to Denmark. The countdown is over. Fifth cool reason that you should make it to the Winter Olympics is the fact that you're at the Olympics. There is no cooler place to be an athlete. The goal for any elite athlete is to become as good as they can. Being at the Olympics is per definition the highest level you can get in sports. It is the main event in your career. 
and that makes it the main reason you should try and aim for the Olympics. So the Olympics is just so big. I'm used to the world of skating cheering at me and watching me when I compete, but here it is really just the entire world. The support you feel when you're at the Olympics. This YouTube channel might be the greatest example. All the comments I received in my previous vlogs have just made a huge difference. Um, knowing that so many people are following and so many people are cheering at you, because in the end, being an athlete is all about appreciation, that people care and having that sort of approval is, is what we fight for every day. That's what makes the Olympics something special. I hope this motivated you to chase your dreams. Tune in next time we're competing at the Olympics and, and cheers on. Thanks for watching this vlog. It is one of many. I uh, think this is super fun and few people get to the Olympics and few people share it. So I decided that I would try and do that so we all get the feeling that we went to Beijing a little and hopefully Milano. See you for the next vlog. Thanks for watching.